What I found. It's got mom's. No crap, it's mom's. I don't think I'm ready to open it yet. Fine, then you don't have to see what's in it. I can just open it and then. I can see what's in it, but you can leave if you want. Hey, youngins. I was just gonna say... I was gonna go check out the old power grid to see if there was any radio connection there. Do any of you wanna come with me? Oh, the power grid. I'll go. Dear Jeremy and Maddie, I'm so sorry I had to leave like this. Life isn't just what I thought anymore. I had bright ideas for your future and what it was going to be like. I hope that you two flourish when I'm gone and be nice to your father, please, mom. Hey you, how are you feeling? A little less overwhelmed, which is good. I took my medicine, so um, if something does happen today, I think I'll be fine, or at least less overwhelmed. And anxious, so... Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt your little sugar plum. I'm just gonna talk to her. Can I at least, um, know what you want to talk to me about, or just come with me? Go, Val. It's just in here. Um, why did you bring me in here? Do I make you nervous? I'm taking that as a yes. The reason why I brought you in here, Valerie, is because I found my mom's suicide note and a bunch of her things in a box. Okay. 
Okay, why are you telling me this? My mom was a coward. She only thought about herself. And she backed away when my dad was being difficult. But I, I'm, I'm sorry that, that you lost your mom. I um, lost my my dad, too. From what? Uh. Um, Michael's getting the help that we need, and he wants to question each one of us later today. He was a former cop, so he wants to question us. But that's okay with you. Where's my brother? Um, he's talking to. Val, actually, in his room. Um, okay. One, one second. <sighs> Jeremy, stop bothering this poor girl. Oh, and I see that you opened Mom's suicide box. How great of you to do that. Excuse me. Who's older here? Val, you go relax. Okay. I'll deal with him. Okay, just be civil. Don't kill each other. You know, instead of luring a girl in here that has a boyfriend already, and has told you that already, it's not a great idea. Just because you're still not over Amy? You are just terrible. Honestly. Yeah, Amelia was was really pretty, she was nice, she was everything, but Honestly, you treated her like crap, and she let you. She put up with all of your problems and trauma that you have, and you still treat her like nothing. I don't need your explanation, okay? I know that I messed up, okay? I messed up. I wish I could get... Amelia back, but I can't. Okay, she's... she's dead. <laughs> That's because you killed her, Jeremy. You killed your own girlfriend because she wasn't enough for your... I don't know what you have. You have PTSD because mom killed herself 12 years ago, Jeremy. 12 years ago, and you're still not over it. Oh, Jeremy, I really cared about you. And I still do. But you've changed. You're twisted. You can't... You can't have any normal relationships because you're psychotic. That's just not an easy personality to deal with. Have fun in jail. <laughs> Jeremy, please don't. I'm done with you, okay? I'm done with you. Oh, you're really silly for thinking that you can just be completely done with me. 
Daddy. You can never be done with me. I'm your brother. Are you kidding me right now? You killed so many people. Okay? I'm not going to be the next one. Keep telling yourself that. Time to die. You too. Please. Please take my offer. I really don't want anything bad to happen to any of you. Also, you should get some rest. Now, you look terrible. You look like you've been through some stuff today. I think you should take Arrest? I'm not gonna be okay. Do you believe me? Val. You just don't want to die. I don't want you to die yet. I love you. I love you too. I... I don't know who, if we're gonna make it out alive. Now, but... Can I just ask you something? It'll leave really fast. What do you do you wanna marry me?